and we'll fly. Oh, we'll fly. Hello, it's your boy David. Off. I just want to share my quick thoughts on Marvel's Agents of Shield season five. It's a really good show at the moment. Um, the last three seasons, specifically seasons three, four, and five, have just been getting better and better. I thought season five was a very good, solid series with an emotional ending. That ending hit hard a bit. Hit really hard. It gave a nice ending as well. Um, I think it's being renewed though. Being renewed for season six, which I'm looking forward to. This season, I mean, this show starts off really slow, like. They gave a lot of adverts, a lot of promos to make out like it's a massive superhero show from the Marvel Universe on a TV show. Um, but a lot of people I think were underwhelmed by it, a lot of people were put off by season one, which is fair enough. Um, season two wasn't that good either, but for the people that stayed, like me, we got the reward of seasons three, four and five, which is just brilliant. The best season for me though, season four, season four was just like amazing for me, especially with Ghost Rider in there as well. I, ho I hope he comes back. I really hope he comes back because he was, he was a good Ghost Rider. Um, he wasn't in the season though. Um, but yeah, no spoilers as I said, so I can't really say much. But the final battle, I kind of like it went. It went how I think it, it would go, but it was a bit anticlimactic, a little, a little bit. Like the final battle seemed a little bit like it just ended a bit. It, it, it was a bit too fast in my opinion. But I get it. I, I, I get the whole thing. And it didn't need to go on for longer to be fair, but yeah. Um, the final battle I think just could have been a little cooler, but you know, it's, it's a TV show, so limitations with budget and stuff. Basically this show, no spoilers, basically the world is, the world is destroyed and they're in the future on a, on a ship in space controlled by the Kree. And the Kree have controlled whoever is left, the human race, basically. And uh, the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. They have to go back in time to fix everything. So that's basically what the plot of the whole season is. And yeah, um, it's just done really well. A lot of twists and turns, uh, some cool new characters as well. And uh, yeah, it was pretty interesting. And I'm looking forward now to season six. Although, if they ended it now, I think it would have been a perfect ending. I think it was a good ending. But if they're doing more, they're doing more. Looking forward to it. I think there was less budget for this season as well, I'm pretty sure. Because they did Inhumans, which I didn't watch, but they did Inhumans first. And um, I felt because of that, Agents of Steel probably like got less budget. I, I guess so. And um, yeah, but it, it was still pretty good. It was still pretty good. Just just sometimes the CGI looked a little bit, a little bit off. It, it didn't look too good at some at some points. But it, it, it was still it was still good enough. And uh, yeah, I just really enjoyed it. And yeah, three three solid seasons now. Season three was very good, especially the second half. Um, season four amazing. Season five really good with an emotional and a happy ending in a way as well and uh, yeah I'm looking forward to seeing what they do with certain characters in season 6 I'm assuming they're doing it though I am assuming but yeah uh, this was your boy Davidoff please like oh god I forgot the rating rating um, 8.5 out of 10 8.5 this was your boy Davidoff please like share subscribe thanks for watching have a good day and see ya